Hey, it's Clay Trader for BullWarriorStocks.com, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol PHOT. We will take a look at the 60-minute time frame. If you follow my videos, you know that I did this one yesterday, but after the uh, absolutely crazy day today, wanted to do the 60-minute chart again. Real quick, just looking at the daily, you can see, uh, like I said, crazy day, gapped up, ran all the way down there, then was all the way down here, and then finally settled back up there. So all over the place. Uh, but like I said on yesterday's video, I think uh, the 60-minute uh, video does a better, or 60-minute time frame, I should say, does a better job of breaking down the action. So uh, all these lines you see here were from the previous times I've done the video. And the first thing I want to start off with, if you go back and watch the video from yesterday, you heard me say that this level right here was the ideal level, meaning ideally if the price can continue to hold above here, that's going to make the chart look extra strong. And uh, despite all the, the Dow Jones action today right here, you can see it was still able to hold above this level right there, which is that point. 1, 8. So 18 cents held, uh, and that in and of itself was a nice little victory there. Sure, if you're a day trader and you bought up here or something like that with a mission of you know scalping out real quick, uh, you could care less about that. But as far as the overall chart is concerned, uh, good to see that 18 cents was still able to hold strong. So that remains uh, that uh, ideal level of support. On that same note, even if it were to fail, you still do have all these other levels of support below you, but very good sign to see it hold strong today. Now you can also see I want to extend this line across. This was the resistance I talked about, and you can see when the price was able to get above it there, uh, really shot up. So this was a very exciting hour right here when the, the market opened, and then you can see profit takers finally stepped in. Not a big shock when you know the price has moved as much as it has. There's going to be some profit taking. I mean, that is the point of the market. That's why people play stocks, to, to make money. You can only make money by selling. So looks like some profit taking here and then you know it all kind of makes sense uh, afternoon time things finally uh, settled out here and then going into the last hour very nice action right here a nice green candle and a little bit of a volume increase you can see it's reapproaching this resistance up here at uh, 0 0.2075 but we now do have some other levels of resistance we can talk about uh, after 0.2075 the next level of resistance is just going to be right up there at uh, 22 and a half cents and then after 22 and a half cents just simply right up there uh, where the profit takers decided to step in today up at 25 cents so that is where the chart currently stands uh, you know again good day uh, very impressive to see it hold up above 18 cents so we'll have to see what next week brings but all in all uh, you know nice way to end the week for the bulls if there are any other questions on it please let me know if not i'd like to direct your attention down here to my private trading group what it is is it's a group of traders from beginners all the way up to uh, veterans who have been trading for a while i send out weekly trade ideas and it's a good environment to learn in uh, and it's if you're just simply looking for some additional trade ideas every week then it's also good for that so i uh, don't really take my word for it you know just up above here click on the testimonials and you can read what members are saying so you don't have to take my word for it read what other traders are saying and hopefully you decide to join us and hopefully you decide to at least uh, check us out if anything so again phot uh, thanks for listening and have a great weekend